Breaking news. Customers at Market Basket say that they have seen a ghost in the frozen pea aisle. Here is Sarah and Gladys live at the scene. Hi, my name is Gladys, and I'd like to interview you about the Market Basket ghost. My, my name is Gabby, and I'm an employee at Market Basket. Okay, have you seen the ghost? Yes, late at night one day when I was working, I thought I saw something ghostly, but I didn't quite know what it was. What section of Market Basket was it? The frozen pea aisle. What did it look like? It was kind of like an invisible whitish thing. Thank you for giving us your opinion. Back to you in the studio. <laughs> we have found the Market Basket ghost and we are going to interview him. Hello. I'm Gladys and I'm an interviewer. I'd like to interview you because you're the Market Basket ghost. Um, why did you choose Market Basket? Um, I actually just wanted some groceries. Then why are you a ghost? Uh, it's a long story. What's the story? Well, I died from old age. But why did you choose to stay at Market Basket for so long? Uh, I don't know. When will you leave Market Basket? Hmm. I'm thinking maybe around today. Okay, thank you. Back to you in the studio. Thank you, Gladys. Now let's go back to Sarah live at, on the scene. Hi, my name is Sarah and I'm a reporter. Hello, my name is Annette and I am the store manager here. Okay, I'm just gonna ask you a few questions. How do you think this ghost is affecting your store? Well, some good and some bad. Elaborate a little bit. Some people um, want to come to the store because they want to find the ghost and some people are afraid how do you think this is affecting your sales? Well, there are a tiny bit more people buying peas. Well, that's good. Do you believe in the ghost? Kind of. Okay. How do you think this is affecting how many people come to your store? Is it like the same people coming or are there more people coming and that's why you think there are more sales of peas? There are some different people coming. There are the same people, but there are some more different people. Okay. Back to you in the station. Now let's go live back to the scene at Market Basket. Hi, my name is Sarah and I'm a reporter. Hi, my name is Carlito and I'm a customer. Do you believe in this ghost? Yes. Do you, did you see it? Yes, it threw frozen peas at me. Okay. Did you sense a presence little around it? Yes, it was very cold. Most people say that. Did it look like anything? It looked like a bed sheet. Was it wavy? Not really. Oh, most people say it is. Do you think that this will ever affect you going to the store again? No. Okay. Well, there you have it, folks. Back to the station. Looks like we have a haunting on our hands. Thank you for watching. WC TV News. Tune in for tomorrow for another story. Ooh.